Okay. Okay. Here we have a right coxal bone, and you know this is because the um, the auricular surface here is always medial, and then it's always anterior. Okay. First, you have the uh, acetabulum, which is is the little um, like socket right here, and this is where the femur would go in. And then you have the ilium, which is if you cut this off, it would just be the top part of the bone. And then you have the ala, which is right here, and the ala is enclosed by the posterior gluteal line and the anterior gluteal line. So that's the ala. Then you have, um, as I mentioned, the anterior gluteal line here. Then you have the anterior inferior iliac spine, anterior in superior iliac spine. Then you have the auricular surface right here. The, the greater sciatic notch is right here. The iliac crest is on top right here. The iliac fossa is on the other side and it's the indentation here. The inferior gluteal line is is the line right here. And then sorry, then you have the pelvic brim which is right here and it would right there and it would connect right here. And then it would connect with the other one. Um, okay. And then you have the posterior gluteal line which is right here this little like crest right there and then you have the posterior inferior iliac spine then you have the posterior superior iliac spine there and then um, okay and then next you have the ischium which is if you cut this right there and then you make a little T this part is the ischium the ischium has ischial ramus which is down here it has the ischial spine which is this little like notch right there then you have the ischial tuberosity which is this right here which is right there on on the over there. Mm -hmm. Wait, where? Ischial. Right here. Ischial tuberosity. Oh yeah, yes. Excuse me. <laughs> Ischial tuberosity, and then you have um, the lesser sciatic notch. So greater sciatic notch, ischial spine, uh, ischial tuberosity, and lesser sciatic notch. Yes. And then um, you have the obturator foramen, which is the big hole right there. And then the other half of the T makes the pubic bone. On this side it would be right here. This is the pubic bone. Okay, and then you have the inferior pubic ramus, which is down here. Then you have the pubic body, which is this area right here. You have the pubic crest, which uh, combines with the uh, pubic tubercle right there. So it would be over there, it would be the crest right here. And the tubercles kind of like, yeah. Okay. And then you have the pubic symphysis, which is only evident right there. This is the pubic symphysis. And lastly, you have the superior pubic ramus, which is this area right here. And that composes your right coxal.